In prison, I made myself a cup of coffee every morning. I'd take a big scoop of the yellow bag instant coffee, stick it in my cup, and I'd go over to the hot water pot or to the hot water spigot on the water fountain and then mix it up. During lockdowns, we couldn't get out of our cells, so I'd use a stinger instead. And this is an electrical wire that has a piece of steel wool wrapped around it that I can drop down in the water, and when I plug it in, it'll turn that electricity into heat and boil the water. One time, my cell partner came up with some real brew coffee, and it wasn't like we had a coffee maker or a filter. So we took our cleanest, dirty sock, we packed it full of coffee, we boiled some water, and we dunked it down in there. And let me tell you, that was some amazing coffee. And it became such a part of my life and really everybody's life that when they ran out of coffee at the store, you almost had a riot. Guys would normally sell shots of coffee for a soup or for a stamp, and all of a sudden it became a bag of chips or a honey bun, started going for a dollar for a shot of coffee because everybody needed it that bad. And just like when they stopped selling tobacco, so contraband cigarette values went through the roof, when the store ran out of coffee, the value of coffee went through the roof.